ones, Jackal Wolf back in Sky Factory 4 with another five minutes. That's how I did it. Now, if you've been following along, you know that we are working our way through the advancement book. Uh, last episode, we got the This Tree is Forever and Trees to Diamonds. Uh, we also did the Stop Slabbing Yourself and the Study in the Dark Arts. Uh, this episode, we're going to focus on the Oink Tree, which is to craft a bacon sapling. I was going to try to do the Crafted Donut Sapling at the same time, but uh, these do take a little bit of uh, prep work, so I think this is going to work better as two videos instead of one. Uh, but to start, we are first going to need to get some uh, sugar cane in our world to make some sugar. Now, I could purchase this from the market and I will be buying stuff from the market, uh, but there is actually no real reason for me to do that, at least not to, to purchase uh, sugar cane seeds, uh, because I've got a, a ton of leaves and all we need to do is take these leaves, place them in a crushing tub, and then crush and... Oh, there we go, right there. There we go. Sugar cane seeds. You can see Jackal Wolf has made the advancement citizen cane. So that is one of the farming advancements, uh, but it is not the one that's necessary for us right here today. So uh, next up, what we're going to want to do is to grow these uh, sugar cane saplings. Now, uh, I could place them in the world next to a water source and they will grow up uh, nice and fine, but uh, there is a, a quicker way of doing that, and that is to make ourselves some snad. Now, snad is simply two pieces of sand in a crafting table, uh, makes that one piece of snad and we'll just go make a little bit of room here and uh, to make things easy why don't we just pop that there and quickly throw that i didn't lose okay good i was worried i was going to lose the torch over there um everything's looking really good so what we're going to do now is we're going to take these uh sugarcane seeds we're going to place them onto the um the, the uh, block of snad we're going to take a lever place it on the uh the block of snad and then we're just going to go click 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 and there we go we just this is quicker than uh you actually think it is um but it is a slowly growing and then once it gets to be full grown this is just going to take off you can see it is growing up really, really, really quickly here. So I don't need that much of it, but let's go and we'll break these guys right here. And next up, what we want to do is we want to turn this sugar cane into some sugar. Now take that sugar cane, we're going to throw it into our inventory and there we go, we have got some sugar. Now let's go and place the sugar over here uh, while we are thinking about it. And then we're going to go and continue on with a couple of other uh, items we need for this recipe. Uh, next up is going to be bacon. We need three strips of bacon if you've been conservative, uh, you might still have your original piece of bacon uh, from uh, the, I guess, initial equipment that you start with uh, when you start up Sky Factory 3. So I'm going to put that initial piece right there. But we still need two more pieces of bacon. Now, this is going to require some pork chops. I could go and either, you know, grow some more pigs or harvest some more pigs. Uh, but what I think might be a little bit more uh, interesting is for us to buy some pork chops uh, from the market. Now, to buy the pork chops from the market, we are going to need, oh, park, we need pork. We're going to need some carrots. Now, to make carrots, we can, again, purchase these from um, the uh, the farmer's market here. And that is eight wheat. So I've got eight wheat right handy. There we go. There is our carrot seed. Now, I'm going to come over here back to my little garden area. And let's just go and place that down right there. Now, previously, we used a... Uh, I guess it was uh, the watering can to speed this process up. What we want to do today is we're going to make ourselves a sprinkler. Now, to make a sprinkler, it is uh, three iron bars in a crafting table with a water bucket and three bone blocks gets us a sprinkler. Now, this is another advancement, sick sprinkler, and we should be able to right click this right there. And we actually harvested that. That was just because I clicked on it. Now, this it has to be placed on top of a source block of water. And and it should speed up this process quite a bit. I don't know if it's much quicker than a uh, watering can. It actually does not look like it is much quicker, quicker than a watering can. Uh, but uh, what we can do is just sort of wait here for this, or I may end up going and breaking out the watering can. This is probably a good passive um, watering system rather than an active watering system. But uh almost I'm tempted to put them side by side just to see if it grows any little better but um I don't know. let's give this a moment and we'll see what happens 
Okay guys, so I've given this a few minutes and this is not very quick. It's not as quick as the watering can. So you know what, let's just go, we're gonna go and grab that watering can and let's do this the uh, the nice easy way. We're gonna shift click on it and there you go. This is going really, really quick. We'll grab those carrots and go throw them down there and just keep doing this whole process again. And all we need was, uh, I think it was eight carrots, a two by ourselves, a pork chop. We're going to need two pork chops. So what we're going to need is a 16 carrots and we should be able to get these pretty, pretty quick. We go one, two, and three. And tell you what, let's go put that down there. And yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut here and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so there is my 16 carrots and I don't know how much this will... This uh, sprinkler worked. Uh, I, I do think it speeds things up a little bit, but obviously uh, not as uh, much as I would have liked. So we're going to leave that there. We're going to come back over to the market. We're going to right click on there. 16 carrots. We're going to throw in that pork chop. There we go. We've got two raw pork chops. And what we're going to do is we're just going to need to cook these in a furnace, uh, which shouldn't be a problem. While these are cooking, we're going to need to make one more item, and that is going to be a chopping block. Now, there is, similar to the grindstone, there is a horse version of this uh, where you could hook it up to a horse, and he will walk around and basically, you know, chop or grind whatever it is that you're, you're using. Unless you've got a ton of things to chop or grind, uh, the horse way is not the way to go. I have made a video on that. Uh, you can go check that out. I think it's like episode seven of my special videos but for two pieces of bacon uh it just makes sense just to use this regular chopping block so uh, to make a chopping block it is one oak wood and one flint in a crafting table gets you uh but gets you two chopping blocks which uh seems a little bit overdone but we're going to place one of them there i'm not going to worry about the other one our two pork chops should be done so let's take those out and we're going to go and place them onto the chopping block one at a time. It won't let you, you know, stack these up like the grinder does. And then we're just going to go and right or uh, left click on the chopping block. You can see the progress bar up top is getting higher. And there we go. And actually, we got two pieces of bacon. Uh, so we only needed the one pork chop. I actually was surprised about that. We got three pieces of bacon. So I'm really curious now because I've done this before and I did not think you got so much bacon. So let's go chop. See, we only got two pieces of bacon that time. So I guess it is a little bit of a random drop each and every time, but we're gonna take two more of these pieces of bacon. We're gonna go, we're gonna place them in a crafting table and there you go, there is our bacon sapling. So the bacon sapling is a apple sapling, which we've got from our uh, previous apple saplings, uh, the piece of sugar and three pieces of bacon. That gets us our bacon sapling. You see, we have made the advancement oink tree. We're gonna come over here and let's go place that into our, um, you know, Hopping bonsai, and that should be growing up really good. And if we take a look in our advancement book, we are down to one advancement. That is going to be next episode, but I am really excited to finish off this first page. But uh, that is going to be it for this one, guys. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please think about leaving a like and a subscribe. Uh, you can follow me on Twitter at Jekyll Wolf. Uh, as well, check out the links below. Check out the description below. There is a link to my Discord page. I would love it if you guys stopped by to say hi. Uh, as well, I've been streaming modded Minecraft on Saturday nights, uh, uh, 8 o'clock Mountain Standard Time uh, on Twitch. Yeah. So, you know, if you would uh, stop by and say hi there, I would absolutely appreciate that as well. But that is it. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.